Yo yo, what's up? It's Shark Gaming and I'm back with another player review. And today the player in focus is the 100 rated Cristiano Ronaldo, the new one. I packed him a couple hours ago in the Juventus Club selection pack on my third try after packing Chesney and Ramsey beforehand. I immediately maxed him out and went to test him and I have a few problems with the card but we'll talk about that later because trust me you guys are gonna want to hear what I have to say because uh, these problems are very very serious and very concerning so yeah prior to this card I only had the original base card and that max is at 97 and I was doing pretty well with it as you guys can see here there's just a light comparison between the two cards and on paper the new featured card is literally better in all areas but as we go further in this video we shall properly prove or decide if that is indeed true about the stats of the cards in game because i tend to disagree i did a speed test and the base card is just 0.1 of a second faster now to some of my concerns about the player I really like what Konami has done with this card in terms of gameplay because if you have been watching Juventus play in real life, you guys would have realized that Cristiano is not as goal hungry or incisive as he once was and it could be that he's catching up in age but at the same time he's still pacey and quick and in front of goal we all know Cristiano Ronaldo will produce what he's supposed to be doing but that just leaves me to believe that he's just a manager. Maybe it's just sorry about formation and tactics because CR7 has been staying back more often, passing more, making less runs and hitting the woodwork a lot and it's very annoying because with this gameplay, even though he has the stats, he's not making the runs in order to produce the goals that you want. Like I'm going to show you guys replays like this, that Cristiano Ronaldo collects the ball, passes off the ball to a hazard on the wing and he instead of going towards the goal look where he's <laughs> Cristiano Ronaldo went on the wing so I'm not sure if it's like I'm not sure if it's a part of um the prolific winger trait that is there but come on if hazard goes that way you're really going to leave Beckham down there by itself that doesn't make any sense to me Cristiano Ronaldo didn't run forward he ran to the side to me that's very like I don't know if that's a bug within the card but yeah like he's just been sitting back and passing and at the same time i appreciate that but that's not why i want christian ronaldo if i wanted passes i'd just use hazard or i'd use any person with good passing i use christian ronaldo because he's christian ronaldo another thing that i've actually picked up is that this is the base card stats right here where it has 99 counter attack and 99 position and in the featured player it's 59 counter attack and 99 position so it leads you to believe that the player is actually meant to be more of a passing and possession style baller like he's not meant to be that old Cristiano Ronaldo where counter attacks you know when he used to play for Manchester United or Real Madrid and counter attacks were made you know that you know yeah we don't expect that anymore as you can see in this replay right here instead of Cristiano Ronaldo going for the ball he retracts and Beckham is the only one that goes forward I even tried doing free kicks and I'm not the best on free kicks but he still has it where free kicks are concerned where he'll take like let's say 10 and 5 score or 6 score and when they score some decent ones sadly i didn't get any um good one i only got the ones on the training ground and literally anybody can score those so it doesn't make any sense that i put them in but i've been really really annoyed with the card it still has a lot of positives because Cristiano ronaldo is Cristiano ronaldo and he can still contribute to an attack but as i'm saying that he's just not as clinical as he was before so if i'm being completely honest the base card is just as good so i mean you're not really missing out on anything yeah sure he's 100 and he's 101 rated at center forward but he's not making the runs to be a center forward majority of the time you're looking for runs and christian ronaldo is not making the runs as i said he's good he's still christian ronaldo he'll still score the stunners as you can see he just scored a long shot or a good um from a good distance I mean, in some dis in some instances, you can actually see that when you put him to work on left wing, he'll actually make decent runs. But when he's playing center forward, he's not making the proper runs. So it's like your right wing or your left wing have to interlap and become the striker in that case. And Cristiano Ronaldo turns to be some sort of center mid or defensive mid, and I'm like, what the hell? 
uh, I'm, I don't, I'm not, like, I lost at words to really describe it. As I said, I like the player. I'm grateful that I like him, but he's not all that. He's literally not all that, and he's very annoying. He still makes decent runs. He still overpowers defenders, all of those lovely stuff. But in terms of his um, incisiveness and his goal, his thirst for goals and stuff like that, he's not that same Christian Ronaldo. And I don't know. It's, as I said, you guys can comment down below and tell me if you guys are having the same problem. As I said, I still score a lot of goals with him, and I'm grateful that I have scored a lot of goals with him. But he's just not like they're so different it's not even funny the cards are so different so you know it's not what i really expected but at the same time i'm glad that konami did this but yeah don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe i'm out